Hey guys, today I have a massive clothing and accessory haul for you. I've collected these things over the past couple of months and just letting you know, I'm now on a spending ban. Just putting that out there. <laughs> Shopping is my weakness. Okay, let's get into the haul. First up, I went to H&M in Sydney when I went for eye mats with Danielle. Sorry if these clothes are a little bit crinkled. I've just had them sitting in their bags. First, I got this peach colored shirt top and it has long sleeves, but it's a really, really lovely fabric. Like it's nice and light. I just love the blush peach color. So I picked that one up and it was $29.95. I got an Australian 12 for that. Have you guys ever been to H&M in Australia? Because the feeding rooms have like a line to get in about 50 people long and we were not going to wait. I picked up two things that didn't really fit that well. The first thing are these little pant things. I don't know. They're like jegging kind of things. They just have like an elastic band and I thought that they, they would be a bit more stretchy than they are. This really basic t-shirt thing and it has a bit of a longer sleeve. This one's a really slinky comfortable fabric and I picked up a medium and it was $14.95. This one's a bit more like office appropriate and I don't know I was just like a drawn to it I think by the color but it's this blush top. It just has a v-neck and it's a very silky material. This one was $19.95 and I picked up a size 12. Lastly from H&M I don't know if I can pull this off but I picked up this little ruffle top. I didn't realize it was as cropped as it is but I got that in a size 12 and I don't know if I can pull it off but maybe I can find like the right bottoms to pull it off with because I just like it because I don't own anything ruffles with ruffles this much, but it kind of makes my boobs look really big. So I went shopping on my birthday. We went to High Point and I went to Tempt and Dotty. I'll do Tempt first. I got this really casual white basic top. This one was only $9.95, but I'm pretty sure it's that cheap because I think you it's one of those tops that you get one wear out of and then it will shrink or just change shape and I hate that. But I got suckered into it because it just looks really nice and casual and the material is like really flowy and nice for summer. This dress, I think I want to wear like Christmas Day or Boxing Day. It is so pretty. This white dress here with the pattern in the material, like a kind of cut through... I don't know how to describe it, but it's like a skater dress. It comes in around the waist and it has a band around there and then it poofs out and it has nice thick straps as well. This one was $40 and I got this one in a size medium. If you watch me on like Instagram and if you see my spring lookbook, you know that I love these shorts. I picked up another pair of these shorts. These are like a tan color and they're just high waisted and have a little bow at the front, kind of like paper bag shorts. But anyway, they are so nice and these ones are a size 12 and they're $19.95. They're color is called camel camel I said that really weird camel and then in usual crystal style I picked up two of the same dresses in different colors so I wore this one to the Sephora opening and I just I just love the design of the dresses like, they're just so casual but then you can dress them up so easily so it's like a shirt dress and it's this beau it's beau <laughs> It's a blue, a very light sky blue. It has a zip and then it has little buttons as well. And it has a little tie around your waist kind of thing. And it can scrunch up at the back as well. These are a good length. They're a nice fit. And I picked it up in white as well. Only problem is with the white, it's really like frayed around the edges. And I didn't notice it until I got it home. And oh my god, get this. I was steaming it. And then in the pockets were all these tags from like jewelry and everything. So someone had taken it into the change rooms or maybe not even they've just like stolen the jewelry and put the tags in the pockets and I'm like oh my god the person who like packed it for me and I when I bought it didn't even realize these ones were $39.95 each as well but it was my birthday so I let myself shop one word of my shopping advice would be never buy anything full price Apart from if it's valuable or tempt or even H&M, like that's cheap enough. But Dottie always have a sale. Never buy anything full price at Dottie because they always have like a 30% off and even forever new, I always make sure because they are a little bit of that extra higher price point, I always make sure I wait for the 25% off or 30% off before I make my purchases or I'll wait till something comes on sale. I think there were maybe two online shops in this little bit here and then there I went into the store as well but I'll include that in my next haul. I think they still even have some of this stuff but this is a little crop top and this was $9.95. I got it in a size large and after you wear it it kind of 
um, doesn't keep its shape around the middle so a medium probably would have fitted me better but I think that they only had a large at the time so it was only $10. I love their denim jacket so I picked up the light colored like bleached kind of one. I do have one from a few years back that I wear and I always get questions on it and it's like a biker kind of zippy one um, but it's from a few years ago but it fits really nicely so I thought I'd get this one so I can wear it and actually you guys can pick it up. This top though I wore it in my spring lookbook and it's so cute. I even wore it to iMats. It's this little cute scalloped top and it's like lace. It's a crop top and it's so adorable. I got this one in a size medium and I think it's on sale now for like $30. I picked up two of these but here's the first one. This is like a knitted top that kind of sits like the one that I'm wearing like with the straps that go like that, but it's a knitted one. I wanted these so badly when they when they first came out. I think they were like $40 each. Got this for $9.95. I did get the large because I think that they only had the large online, but it's okay. I just got it for filming. Like I wouldn't wear this out in public, I don't think, because it is kind of cropped. Um, the only thing is it's because it is a large, it kind of like yeah, it's a little bit risque over here. <laughs> These singlet tops, these are just basic singlet tops and they're not fitted, they just like kind of flow out. I got a rust colored one and then this kind of, this green colored one. I don't, what kind of green would you call this? It's not like an aqua, it's like a, not like an emerald, I don't know what you'd call it. A sea green? Yeah, maybe sea green. So I picked up two of these, I think these were like $10. I haven't even tried this on to be honest, but I just thought it was like a nice basic black top and it was $10 and it's like a knitted kind of one, has a higher neckline, no sleeves and it's quite long as well. So these jackets though, oh my goodness, these are so cute, these little pleather jackets. They have like a little bit of stretch there and they're cropped, they fit me so, so nicely. Uh, I think these ones are originally like $80, but of course, get them on sale, girls. Another sale top. This one was again $9.95 and it's a cream colored like roll neck top. Perfect for filming. So I picked that one up. It's another crop top, but this one's got like a bit of a high neck. So yeah, it sits like that what size. I got a medium in this one and again, $9.95. I like that. It has the little cap sleeves. I think I got it in white. Oh no, this one's like the stripy one. So this one I got in a medium. Here's another one of those basic singlets in a black. I got one of the, I think I got a black one as well, but it's just like a big basic top. I got a large, so I hope it's not too sheer. It is very, very white. What I'm wearing is white, but this is white. Did that make sense? <laughs> This one is like a really nice slinky material. I thought it'd be cute with just jeans or shorts or whatever like that. I had wanted one of these tops for ages and it's just a top with a tie neck thing. This one's now on sale for like $30 I think, but I got it with 30% off. The other thing is the sleeves are a little bit long. This is a size 12 and the sleeves are just a little bit long for me, but I am kind of short. Here is the gray top that I was talking about before that I have the white one. $35.95 was the original pricing of that one. And I got this knitted skirt. What what size did I, I got a size 12 I haven't even tried it on but I thought because it was like 20 bucks or ten dollars be nice in winter like it feels nice and warm it's really good to get winter stuff on sale at this time of year if you can just because then you can get it for the next year I got pretty basic stuff so it still should be in fashion then and lastly from Dottie I got the pleather jacket in this beautiful dusty rose kind of color as well love it forever new had a 25% off sale this top here I wore on my birthday it's like a flannel fl a flannel <laughs> it's a flannel and it's just beautiful pinks and grays and I just adore it so I actually paired it with this really cute skater skirt that's white for my birthday check out my Instagram if you want to see photos of it on this top is still in the sale section and it is so lovely on I just can't wait to wear it I've been like saving it kind of for a special occasion but it is this white top and the neck kind of wraps around I don't know how to describe it but you'll see it when it's on it sits so nicely and it's got elastic down the bottom and at first I was like oh but but it sits beautifully with jeans, with any kind of pants. It looks amazing. This one was originally 60, but I think I got it for around 30 or less. Got some of the poppy mid-rise uh, ankle grazer jeans in this mid-blue color, and I've actually got some other ones in another color. Um, but these ones were on sale for, I think, 
$50 with maybe an extra percentage off. They have rips at the knees, which is really cute. And then some distressing up here. Next is this gray top. It's a ribbed top and sleeveless high neck. And I just thought it was like a nice basic kind of thing to have. Next is this scarf. It's just a really nice blush colored scarf. It feels so nice and smooth. And I think it was around $15, maybe less. Then two of the same crop tops because I think they're only like $10 each. Here I have this pink one and it's like a high neck one. Um, really nice material and the same with the cream one. I think I mentioned in my last haul I kind of stick to buying the crop tops from Forever New because they are just really nice quality. And for $10 each, like, yeah, they're beautiful. And lastly, from Forever New, I got a bag. Oh, this is so cute. Like, oh, it's just got a chain strap. So you hook the chain on from there to there, but it can also be used as a clutch, which is really cute. Quilted detail, I think that's so gorgeous. I forgot to show you this really cute light pink parka jacket type thing. I absolutely adore it. I also picked this one up in the sales section at the time, but just keep an eye out for the jackets because they are such good quality. Now I did film a New Zealand haul, but I haven't got it up in time, so I'm just including the clothes in this section, which I'm sure you've already seen before. This skirt, which you can actually get from Valley Girl or Tempt in Australia, it's from Moreau. This was like $10. It's just a tan colored, uh, bodycon skirt. Okay, so you know the shorts that I had before, those tan camel colored ones? Well, I kind of have a bit of an obsession going on. I got them in white and navy and a blush color. If you've seen my spring lookbook, I wore these two and they are so comfortable and they feel really nice. The material is so nice and they're only 20 bucks each. Valley Girl, which is like paper scissors, I picked up a long cardigan and I also have it in white as well. It was on sale for $13, I think, but it's a nice ribbed material and it's nice and light, like not too heavy for spring and summer. Also from Paper Scissors, this bodycon skirt. It's just a nice stripy one. I have a shorter one, which is from Tempt. It's from Valley Girl actually, but I wanted a bit of a longer one because the other one kind of like rides up a little bit and it's a little bit short and yeah, so that was only like $6. Lastly, from Paper Scissors, I got this shirt dress, which is like a blush color. This one, the quality isn't exactly there, but I really love the color and the style of it. Um, this one was $30, and I got it in a size 14 because I tried on the size 12, and it was gaping so much at the boobs. I'm hoping it kind of fits all right, but I really love the style of it. From Moreau, I picked up this gray cardigan, which is a really, really lovely fit, and uh, it's very similar to the other ones that I got from Paper Scissors. Like, it has a little slit down the side and yeah it's just really really nice and I think it was $20 yes very nice and neutral I picked up two things from farmers and I'd never been to farmers before but it apparently it's like our Myers so this beautiful coat is just oh my god I can't even like I haven't worn it yet obviously it's still got its tags on but it's from the brand urban precinct it's this beautiful blush color and then it has lace at the back in the bottom half and it's a long line one as well I'll obviously show it on uh, so you can see what it looks like but Oh my goodness, this is so stunning. They had 30% off, I think, so original price is $90. You may have seen me wear this before, but it is this sparkly top, and I also got it from Farmers. I think it was around $30 with 30% off, or maybe a little bit more. It is from the brand Whistle, and it's just like a silver sparkly top, and it has cute little sleeves. I actually have it needing to be washed, but I don't know how to wash it. I think I need to do it by hand. I had a little voucher to spend at La Visa. It was actually for my birthday last year, so I needed to spend it. It's like not in the right shape, but I picked up this little paper, not paper crown, flower crown. I think it's so cute. I think I'll do like a festival look with it because there's going to be festivals coming up this time of year. So that'll be good. Then I also picked up this gold necklace, which has the two strands and then they just have like little rings down the bottom. I thought it was just really cute and nice and simple. This one was 15 and this one was 17. Also had a voucher to spend at Colette, which was for my birthday last year. And I'd been holding onto it all year. I don't know why, cause I have gone to Colette since but they had a deal going on buy two get one free so I bought three bags this is the first one and it's very like it's that Michael Kors kind of material up here but then it has like a different kind of material here I don't know um, this one is called the Selena panel tote original price is $60 I just loved how simple it looks and yeah like just an everyday bag that is 
really classy. I did feature this one in my lookbook and it is this gorgeous mint bag. Again, the Michael Kors material, like, do you know what I mean? Like that cross hatch kind of stuff. But this is so pretty. I haven't used it for real yet, <laughs> but it, I just couldn't step away from the color. I just thought it was gorgeous and it was the last one there. So I'm like, oh, it's meant to be. And then lastly, I got this little bag here. This one's a little bit smaller than the other ones, but I thought, I still thought it was really nice and classy. So it has the cream colored base and then it has like this black trimming and then some gold hardware on there as well. The handles are a little bit longer, so it can actually slide up there if you need but I usually get the shorter one like the black one where you just like wear it on your arm like that okay so I'm finally finished my massive clothing and accessory haul I hope you guys enjoyed well done if you've stayed through till the end and are you very surprised you didn't see shoes in this haul because I am <laughs> I think in the last haul I made up for it so thank you very much for watching and I will leave a list of other clothing and accessory hauls listed down below don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and go check out my social media links I always post outfit of the days lately so go and check that out. Thanks guys, I'll see you soon. Bye! Then I can do productive lace because this is just a voiceover tutorial because I had the washing on. <laughs> Multitasking, hey? Uh, so I'm going to film a clothing and accessory haul and I'm going to refilm my makeup geek haul because